Yo, what's going on guys? Heine here for another video today, and I'm going to be talking about the new DLC on Rainbow Six Siege. This is the third wave for new characters, and we have Capital and Kavera. In this episode, I'm going to be talking about Capital. If you want to see Kavera, I might do, if this video gets at least 15 likes, then I'll upload it tomorrow, which will be Sunday or Monday, I don't know. But yeah, so if this gets like 15 likes, I would definitely upload it. So let's get straight into Capitel. So Capitel is a new, unique character in the game, which pretty much gets players out of corners, out of camping spots, such as Rook and Doc. So with Capitel, you have one armor speed and three speed. This is pretty good, as you have a light machine gun for this character, which is like... How does that make sense? A one, sp a free speed character for LMG, it's like heaven. But anyway, so let's get straight into the loadouts. So first, gun we're going to be talking about is the Parrot 308 assault rifle. This is pretty much the exact same gun as Ash's gun. So uh, on this gun, you can get four different sides. You can get the red dot, the holographic, the reflex, and the ACOG. At the moment, I'm using the holographic, but Hopefully I'm going to change, depending on how my game style changes, I might change to the ACOG in later games. Um, the three barrels we have on this gun, we have the Suppressor, Flash Hider and the Compensator. I'm going to be playing with the Compensator all the time because it reduces recoil and who doesn't want to reduce recoil? Um, we have two, we have the one, we have two grips for this gun, we have the Vertical and the Angled New Grip. So at the moment I'm using the angled grip. So when I wish, so when I rush in, I can aim faster and kill the enemies before they aim at me. So yeah. So if you want to copy that loadout to get kills, I suggest doing that. <laughs> um, so the camos on this gun, there's a uh, one camo that is unique on every gun, and it's the Para 308 11. On the other two guns, it's I can't remember what they are, but I'm gonna show you in a minute. We have the Brazil, and then we have the I can't even say that Cf Don't know if I said that right, but that camo looks pretty insane. But I don't want to waste. So actually, it's only six thousand five hundred. I might buy that in the, in future days because I've got like hundred and ten k. I don't know what I'm gonna spend the money on. But um, yeah, some basic camos, which everyone already knows about. But yeah, let's get straight into the second gun. So the second gun for Capital is the M249. Most people are like, whoa, F LMGs, I'm staying away from that. But I suggest you should try this gun. Seen as it has four different sights, it has the red dot, holographic, reflex, and ACOG. I suggest buying the A I suggest buying the ACOG and then putting on the compensator so you reduce the recoil. Seeing as it's a fucking LMG, you want to be spraying everywhere, and put the vertical grip on. This way, you can literally stand behind a box in a. Uh, oh, let me try and think of what map. Okay, let's say Oregon. You're on the roof. You can basically aim in to dorms and just get a clear spray on the room, especially when the gun is pretty much. You could say overpowered, but the damage on it and the bullets, it's insane. Like you'll be able to aim. Not aim quicker, but you'll be able to uh, put more bullets into them before they put m bullets into you. If you kind of get what I'm on about, but most people d haven't really tried this. But if you've got the operator, I suggest trying it. I might have gameplay in this uh, footage at the moment, so if there is, hope you enjoy and let's get into the camels. So, the camels for this, we have. Siefador, the Brazil, and just the normal camos. Then we have the Mayhem. I don't particularly like this camo, but it, it changes. It's a little different, to be honest. Yellow, a yellow gun. I'm just gonna stick with the hyena camo or the leopard camo, however you want to call it. I like calling it the hyena because it's pretty much the same pattern. But um, yeah. So that's pretty much all for the. M249 and let's go into uh, the pistol so this pistol is called the PRB92 it's a handgun 
it's the standard 9mm handgun and it's range is pretty insane seeing as its damage is 33 fire rate one bullet so if you've got a trigger finger it's like boom 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 i don't know why i was doing that but um yeah i usually have silencer on these guns seeing as i usually take camera i don't use the pistols at all in this game i just use pistols to either if i get an enemy down i switch guns peel dead or shoot cameras because i don't want people enemies to detect where i am if they hear a normal gunshot so if you use the pistol, then uh, don't have a suppressor on. But if you do, if you don't use the pistol, just use presser. I suggest. And then the cameras for this, we have the same Brazil on the CF door, and then we have the 11. Okay, we got 11 on this one. This one looks not too shabby, but it just doesn't look. It just doesn't look the good. It just doesn't look the best, seeing as the CF door looks insane it, it's got a skull on it who does not want a fucking skull on the game uh, who does not want a fucking skull on a gun but yeah so uh this operator has two gadgets it has a, it has the frag grenades and the stun grenades i suggest using the frag grenades so if you use all your incinerator arrows you can switch to the grenades and then boom get them out corners if they got a shield so if they got a shield, use the grenades and then use the incinerator. But if you've already used the incinerator, just use the grenades. So yeah. Um, headgear for this at the moment we only have two, which is the default and the cadavera. I, I don't know if cad cadavera. I don't think I've said that right. But this is a tier three. It's got a skull. You can see its eye, which is pretty insane. Um, and then we have a skull rain DLC available headgear which you can buy which everyone can buy i don't know if they're gonna release the cadavera cad, cad i'm just gonna give up on the name but let's just call it the school school mask i don't know if they're gonna make that free to all players or just disease pass owners and then make it viable for non-season pass holders but anyway that's what it looks like if anyone wondered what it was um the bio of this character, it was his nickname is basically Capital. His operator name is Vincent Soulez. Date of birth November 17, 1967. Place of birth Nova. I can't even say that second bit. But in Brazil, height 6 foot and weight 190. So I can't I don't even know. 190. Let's just, let's just leave it as that. <laughs> Um, and that's pretty much all that is included for Capital, seen as this is a preview of him, or not a preview, an operator talk about or operator review. So that is pretty much all for Capital. Now I'm going to show you, I basically did some tests with my friend, just now what the uh, crossbow can do, what sort of things can it destroy. So I tested like at least, I think it was five different things I wanted to test so I'm gonna show you some clips now with uh, me talking obviously over the top um, yeah so if you haven't already click the like button I suggest clicking it if you like the video and yeah I'll see you in the next part the first test I tested was seeing if the smoke arrow would affect the smoke grenade gadget so after testing this, nothing particularly happened in blending wise, which I was hoping would happen. But instead, the smoke grenade gadget had more power in strength wise, so it had a larger radius in width and height. So that smoke grenade like had more strength going above and than the smoke arrow. But unfortunately, none of the gadgets blended in or anything, which I was which I wanted to do, I wanted to see if the, the smoke colour changed, the smoke like did anything if it got touched by the other smoke grenade but no nothing happened so that was pretty much all that was test 1 we tested and yeah let's get straight into test 2 so test 2 we tried shooting an arrow, an incinerator arrow and the smoke grenade and the smoke arrow by a Jaeger Unfortunately, after testing this, as you can see on the screen, nothing happened. After
after completing this, I realized, damn, this is electronic stuff. Jaegers won't be able to destroy it. I'm a complete idiot. So uh, anything with electronics would not affect it. So, so fractures, grenades, EMPs, however you want to call them, would not affect these arrows at all. So there's like a double, like, uh -uh. So uh, next we tried shooting the, the incinerator arrow into gadgets to see if they did got destroyed. So after testing this, we tried welcome mat, we tried a Jaeger, we tried smoke grenade gadget, and we tried a nitro cell. After trying all four of these gadgets, nothing particularly happened except the fire just went straight through them and lit the floor on fire. Because Will Griggs is on fire. Your defense is terrifying. Oh my god. Let's just move on. So, uh, test four. I think it's test four. We, we tried shooting a fire arrow at Montogny to see if his shield could protect the fire. But, uh, however, nothing particularly happened. The fire just went straight through the shield and started killing my friend. A ding kill him it just got him down so I don't know if that's an effect but it's probably not but yeah so that's pretty much all the tests we have tested if you know any other tests leave them in the comment section below and I might test them or I probably will test them out in a uh, custom games on my own and if I find any like good ones which you lot have left in the comment section I'll put it in the description or the person who commented say yep this works tick so uh yeah so if you haven't already guessed if this video gets 15 likes by today, or when I get back, obviously, or when I check next, with, well not check next, when I go on it later, then uh, I will upload another video of, I forgot a name now, I'll upload another video of Kavira tomorrow, as sharp as anything, I'll literally edit all night, I won't go to sleep, because you, you guys are amazing, so uh, can we already smash that like button? means a lot. Uh, subscribe if you're new and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.